Hey everybody, welcome back to World of Final Fantasy, where me, Gildam, here to do some exploring in, uh, what is this, Final Fantasy VII Reactor World? I mean, we met Shulk, uh, who was a character from Dirge of Cerberus. I think I was gonna rant about that, but, you know, I might save it, I don't know. But, in the meanwhile, I think you and I both know we have some plot and dialogue to go on about, because, you know, I, I gotta go talk to Shulk. Uh, can we go? This job won't take care of itself. Fantastic! I guess we'll go to the Mako Reactor Zero. Or is it Mako? I never really know how to pronounce that. Watch your step here. This area is full of mirages. It's all up to you now. Good luck. Hey, we got this. Oh yeah. This right here is our time to shine. <laughs> Beautiful. Guess what we get to do? We we have zap puzzles. I mean, it's pretty simple stuff, really, when you get down to it. Now we got the thing working. Sort of. I guess we have to zap it. Okay, alright. I thought there was going to be dialogue, so I was, like, super quiet, but... Uh, I should mention, it's pretty simple if you can tell the solution on how to do. Because you got one, you got two, and then you skidoo. Uh, we got some mirages here, like such. I think I got a new ally. No kid gloves for you. This won't take long. Oh man, I really do have a new ally. Okay, I gotta figure out how to imprison dual-headed lizard thing here. Uh, let's see. I need to get out the abilities. Do I have a, uh, have a Libra? Beautiful. Bi Hydra. Bi Hydra. Alright, let's see what we got for the Bi Hydra here. Uh, we need to leave it. Okay. Last one standing. Got it. So, I guess in terms of things, let's go kick butt. Uh, I should probably not do the defend move. It, interesting, interesting. I can't really tell what's going on here. Uh, okay, so we'll just kill this thing. Oh man, we wrecked it. Okay, alright. Uh, was, was, apparently, I don't know my own strength, but that's alright. Uh, time to end prison. In prison, everybody. New friend, new buddy, new ally. Uh, hopefully. Oh, did I? No, didn't get it. I appeared to be caught. <laughs> it appeared to be caught. I always found that weird in Pokemon when they're just like, it appeared to be caught. Because it, like, as a kid, appeared looked really. It looked really weird to me. Because I was like, what? what? I caught it? I didn't catch it? What's, what's going on? And you know what? I digress. No one really cares about what I have to say. I just want my little dual head lizard thing. Likewise, I got the dual head lizard thing, which is a side evolution. Uh, I was not expecting to catch this thing. I thought I was going to catch something else, but um, I'm not upset. I'm fine with it. I guess I guess I will keep it in my party or something, or maybe I have to put it in the prism case. Uh... Let's see, resilient to fire, both of its mod. Okay, all right. It's like the Doe Duo, except the Lizard. I mean, I can dig this by Hydra. Uh, the other form is a, a dual Lizard, if I'm not mistaken. I definitely have to name this. So, uh, you know how it goes. I, give me a second as I try to figure it out. Hey, everybody. Look what I decided to name my by Hydra. Um... You would think it's Billy Zane, but it's not pronounced Billy Zane. I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm probably just gonna call him Billy Zane, but um, yeah, this is this is uh this is our dual-headed bihydra lizard thing. Um, you might say, why didn't you name it like something really normal? Uh, because I felt like calling it Billy Zane. Now the real question is, who can I swap out? Squiggles, bye Squiggles. I don't need you. Let's get Billy Zane up in this. Because, I mean, uh, Squiggles, Squiggles is alright. I don't hate Squiggles, but at the same time, Squiggles is kind of, like, not really gonna be useful. On the other hand, these two Wobble Stoppers, equally <laughs> not that useful. Actually, they, I might have use for them later. Not right now. 
On the other hand, I just got into a fight with the thing. Don't let your guard down I, just because it's the same battle. It's I don't need it. I don't care. Bye, everybody. Uh, not you guys. You, you guys can stay. They barely do anything to me. <laughs> but uh, so on the other hand, I annihilate everything. This is pretty cool. Everything levels up. That's also pretty cool. Here, I was thinking it wasn't going to be an issue. Also, Final Fantasy VII music. I'm digging this. When will Cloud show up? Uh, that's a real good question. I have a feeling in the near future. Not in this part, though, unfortunately. I know, that's depressing, isn't it? We all want Cloud to just show up and be like, Hey, I'm Cloud. Cloud wouldn't say that, though. Let's be honest. Cloud would be a lot cooler. Oh, man, I'm glad I did not get rid of Peepers. To be honest... Deep down in my heart, I was like, oh man, should I get rid of Peepers? I was thinking about replacing Billy Zane with with Peepers, but I, but I decided against it. Because I was like, what if something like this happens? And I was right. I mean, it's always problematic, you know. Swip, swapping, swipping out your party members is one of those things where it's like, I don't know, man. Is it a brilliant choice? Is it wise? Is it a stack? <laughs> Man, these guys are stupid. I mean, you can, sure, you can try to do the stack thing. It's not going to help you in the slightest. I mean, we're far more proficient in doing what we do. Man, I'm glad to have my mirages back. I got to be honest. I thought it's like the worst kind of nerfing. You know what I mean? It could have been really bad had they prolonged it. It wouldn't have been fun. I think it would have been one of those make or break moments where a lot of people just kind of abandon shit because it's like, you can't do it, man. Oh, they decide to mix it up. There's no numbers. Oh man, there's a challenge here. But if you're, if you're at least semi comprehensible as to what we got going on, it's not that big of an issue. I mean, let's see. We got the beginning little turbine, the second one generator. I'm gonna go with generator. These things look like generators. They kind of have a little bit of a turbine appearance, but. Uh, I don't think there's anything associated with them being a turbine. They're more generator-like. And I solved it. Because I'm not idiotic. At least not that idiotic. Killed him at least can solve basic puzzles. This won't take long. Yeah, th this, this ain't gonna take long. This is stupid. I practically just annihilate everything. I can tank everything. Man, I'm just too OP. Maybe I should have posted a little bit of a challenge, but... Nah, I'm trying to sweet. I'm trying to fly about these things. We all need to get the plot, man. Cause you know it's a let's play. Sure, I could do the whole challenge. I could make this kind of a challenge. I was trying to do a nuzlocke thing, but it fell horribly. I'm not doing that. Not when they hit your death, death so early on. It's unfortunate, man. And I know one hit KO things are like a, are like something you can do in Pokemon, but uh. It's, it's not exactly like Pokemon. It's pretty close, but hey, it's the bridge thing. It's the bridge thing. Oh, I, I know this thing. Uh, Final Fantasy VII, everybody. It's pretty early on when you play the There's Final Fantasy VII. Strange about these mirages. I think some of them are unimprisonable unless you use elf boxes like the one Squalda gave you. Huh? Well, say that again. You mean they're machines, not mirages? Maybe machines. For the maybe. No, that's the impossible. Never the mind. Forget I said it. Okay, it's forgotten. <sighs> well, at least we know how to imprison them. For now. But whatever could Tama be referring to? Oh, I, I, we may never know. What? What? <laughs> This wasn't the Murfkin. I'm ready when you are. Bombs? I don't need to get a bomb. I already have a bomb. Uh, for the most part, I'm seeing a lot of unimpressive stuff going on, so uh, I'm not really too worried about like trying to figure out how to do the thing. So uh, yeah, you know, we're just going through this M Mako Reactor Zero, or maybe it's Mako. Who really knows? Um, I, I am very tempted to call it Mako, but it, it could be Mako. Level 35. Well, let me see. Yeah. Yeah. Where's November is a little weak on the weak side, but that's because she's pretty new to the team. So, uh, I'm not really too worried. Let's just get... What? Right. Let's Mithril Giants? <laughs> Mithril Giants here now? Oh, man. I don't know if I can do this. Um, 
For my money. For my money, let's see what we got going on. Uh, can I use any of the chat? Warrior of Light? Oh, man. Uh, let, let's get some Warrior of Light going on here. Oversoul. Let's try it. Let's get some going on. He, this guy, man. It's been a while since we've seen him. I will banish this darkness once and for all. I mean, that was cool and all, but it didn't really serve what I needed it to. Okay, that did what I needed it to. Sling. I think that's supposed to try to have some toppling effect. Hey, it worked! Also, counter. Lovely. Uh, but the problem is, uh, they're not going to live to see the light of their results, because I'm going to defeat them before they can even do it. And if worse comes to worse, I can always use a wobble stopper. Oh, man. <laughs> Never mind. Apparently my stack toppled over. Okay, let me think. Um, if I was a smart man... You know what? Screw it. I'm not smart. I'm just critical. I'm gonna critical something. Um, let's do it. They're almost dead. They're not dead. Oh, this is gonna be painful. I think, I think we can take it, though. I think we're fine. Okay, let's see. Uh, I need to stack. There we go. All better. And you're dead, so I got one left, but you know, for my money, um... Yeah, let's use the cur the Cura. Let's get the Cura action going on here, because that's a, that's a good thing to get going on. I don't have to worry too much, though. I think I'm fine. I think, if anything else, I'm just imagining things. Okay, you know what? This battle is in the bag. I don't need to focus on it too much. You know what? Let's, let's get... Oh. Right. Well, I guess I'm the fool. But I still won anyway, so, so it's bad. fine. So without further ado, more level ups. Oh man, where's November is getting beefy. Uh, Billy Zane is also getting beefy, or however you pronounce that. Man, Gildan made a challenge, but the worst kind of challenge. Not even being able to figure out how to pronounce that. If someone knows, you get a gold star. Straight up gold star. I would offer some sort of tangible reward, but uh, I, I am poor. <laughs> I'm just a poor, low-class piece of trash. But I'm doing a Let's Play, so I guess I have something. Um, Mimic? Do we have a Mimic? Did we get ambushed by a Mimic? Oh, it's it's the Jackpot Mimic. Uh, oh, okay, it's not a Jackpot. I don't know what it's called, but it's it's, it's definitely in the Mimic line. Um, I'm gonna I'm use Mimic Jackpot. Okay, alright, I didn't know. I didn't know. Let's just well on it. Surely I'll go down if we do that. In fact, I'm, I'm not even going to pay attention. What is it going to do? Instant death? Resistant counter. Oh, it's going to increase the counter rate. Okay. All right. I got it. But you know what? It's going to die. Despite the fact that it has high counter, it's still going to die. It can't. It can't do the thing. It can't live. I already got Cheshire. Why do I need to worry? <laughs> I really don't. This whole place is just a breeze. There's nothing for me to really sweat over. Uh, was there anything else? Nope. It was just a mimic. Just your chance to be like, Oh, I can get a mimic! It it'll be magical. Uh, I can't do anything with that, can I? Okay. Alright. Well, it, for all intents and purposes, I guess I'm gonna have to solve... Oh, it's an, it's an even more elaborate puzzle. They're actually trying to mix things up on me. But it's still not an issue whatsoever. It's still pretty easy. If you can connect the dots, well, I think you'll be fine. I think everyone will be fine. Man, I do have to say, love the layout, but I gotta be honest. Something that's always irritated me, and I know this is just a design oversight. So, we were in Figaro Castle, Final oh, yeah. Fantasy VI, uh, in the desert, and I have no issue with that. And then we were in uh, the prison in Final Fantasy VIII. I can't, I can't remember the exact name but you know the prison and it's all cybernetic and futuristic and like that's all fine and dandy but the thing is now we're in a reactor and the reactor had like a brick layout and Figaro Castle I mean I could also say it probably had some sort of brick layout I could be completely wrong on that but I digress uh, but the prison layout it was all 
futuristic, had LED lights and what have you. There was no sign of, like, brick-like architecture. So it's it's like, what what is the design functionality here? Why is it set up like this? How does it even begin to make sense? I know that's how it looked in its in its game. But it doesn't make sense in the context of how this thing is layered like a triple deck sandwich or something like that. I, it's it's confusing. I, I don't really know how to make it. But I digress, because if I keep thinking about it, I'm never going to get an answer. Some of you might have come up with your own variation on how to do, but... Uh, you know, I'm, I'm just I'm just move on with my life. There's no point in doing the thing. Uh, let me think. I gotta go to this one. Clearly, they're saying go to this one. Connect the dots. I, I did it good. I did it good. Gillum figured out a puzzle. Oh man, okay. Alright, without further ado, um, I'm gonna save this for next time. There's no point in me going on further. I mean, this, this is a good time to stop. Who knows what's gonna happen next? Will I open a gate? Will I cause some sort of malfunction? Will something self-destruct? Will there be explosions? Find out next time.